everyone, I'm Tracy. This is a chair yoga morning routine to get your day started. I'm an acupuncturist and I'm a yoga teacher and I like to combine both of those modalities to get you back to balance. If you like my what I'm doing today, please subscribe to me and give me a thumbs up. Also, leave me a comment, I'd love to hear from you. Okay, so to start your day and to add some Chinese medicine elements, I always want to start your day with a cup of nice warm water before you put anything into your system. That's going to be so great. What we say is to soothe the liver, the liver meridian, and just help you get into a really great space. And now I want you to start rubbing on the external and the what we call the yang channels of your meridian. So what I'm gonna do is I'm pressing on the outside of my arms. And I'm doing this quite firmly because what I'm doing is I'm stimulating the chi, my life force, and my blood inside. I'm also warming up the body by just doing something as simple as this. Okay, so I've worked on the outside now I'm gonna work on the inside. So I'm flipping my arms over and I'm working on the inside of the arms and this is called the yin meridian. So if anybody's familiar with that yin yang symbol, the black and the white, this is what it's all about, creating balance. The yin and the yang in our bodies. Now I'm gonna to start to tap. So I'm gonna take my hand in a gentle fist or you can have fist or you can have it in a nice little C cup. I'm gonna tap on the top of my shoulder. This is gallbladder 21. This is an acupuncture point. It's really great, um, and I use it a lot. I mean, many of my patients who have shoulder tension. So I'm gonna tap right on here. You can also think of yourself as like, I'm tapping myself, I'm gonna have a great day. Good job, good job. Okay, now I'm gonna tap, and I'm gonna to start to tap all the way down the arm. I'm gonna flip my hand over and go and go on the inside of the arm. Perfect, gonna do that again. Top the shoulder, down and on the inside. Now, we're doing that one more time, three times a charm, tap on the top of the shoulder, gallbladder 21, releasing any tension out of the shoulder and the neck, and then bringing it down and then up into the yin meridian. Now I'm gonna come across the chest, tap, 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 tap here, and I'm gonna take both hands and fists and tap right here, right underneath the collarbones, and I take a nice deep breath, inhaling, exhaling. <sighs> One more time, breathing in. Set the intention, it's gonna be a great day, and breathe out. Ah, great, now come on over with the opposite hand, and let's go ahead and tap on the opposite shoulder. Okay, so you can do this as gently or as firmly as you wish. It's your practice. And let's go ahead and go all the way down the outside of the arm, flip it over on the inside of the arm. Okay, we're gonna do this three times. So top at the top, this is the second time, all the way down. Don't forget to breathe, no holding your breath, please. On the inside, reminding ourselves that we're stimulating the chi, the life force, and our blood in our body. Okay, down, this is our last one, and up. Good, now we're gonna come back across, finish it off here with a nice deep breath. Breathe in, and out. Well done, take your hands on top of your thighs. Place your feet down firmly onto the ground. You'll notice I have my socks on in this practice. Well, that's okay, we're not standing up today. I want you to root your feet into the earth. And because it's a morning practice, I'm keeping my meridians, my feet nice and warm. I live in Canada, it's still a little cold here. And there is a point, an acupuncture point, just about two inches above your inside of your ankle that's very dear and precious to you. So as much as possible, I always like to keep that area nice and warm. Okay, so that's for anybody living in cold climates, keep those socks on. If you're living in warm climate, well, it doesn't really matter as much. Let's take our hands on top of the thighs, spread your toes nice and wide, four corners of the feet planted onto the ground. Draw the belly and lift your chest up and let's go ahead and stick our tailbone out and open the chest up a little bit more, rolling the shoulders back and down. This is cow pose on a chair. Good, breathe out, rounding the back, reach to the front of the room with your fingertips, draw the belly into the back, chin to the chest, cat pose. We are putting mobility into the spine with breath, inhaling, Open up the chest, roll the shoulders back, and exhale, rounding the back into cat pose. Great, keep it up. Breathing in, 
opening up. Exhale, breathing out. One more time, breathing in, roll those shoulders back and down, stick the tailbone out, open up the heart. Exhale, round the back, nice cat pose. Draw the belly into the back. Beautiful. Now come on back to neutral, draw the belly in. Let's have the shoulders stacked right on top of the waist. Take your arms all the way up so the palms of the hands touch. Breathe in. Exhale, breathe out, chest up, back straight. Let's do that again. Breathing in, arms up. Exhale, breathing out. One more time, breathing in, breathing out. Let's take the hands up the midline, open up, breathe in, draw the belly in, open up the arms. Relax the shoulders. Okay, again, breathing in, hands touch, breathe out, hands to the heart. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, open up the arms. Big breath. Good. Inhale. Exhale. Chest up, back straight. Draw the chin in slightly. We don't want any protruding necks. Breathing in, lift up. Breathe out. Let's do one more for good measure. Inhale, up. Exhale, hands at the heart. Good. Inhale. And exhale, take your hands right down onto the chair, okay? So I'm firmly planting my hands into the chair. I'm gonna grip onto the sides of the chair. Because it's kind of a morning stretch, I'm gonna get right into this. And I'm going to lean back a little. If you have a nice, comfortable um, back support, go ahead and use that. Lean back a little if you wish. Or if you wanna really make this a good workout, and engage your belly muscles super tight, 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 okay, to support the lower back, not be on the back of the chair, and we're gonna go ahead and take the right foot up, Ooh, and release, okay, up and release. Now, if it's a lazy morning, then you're gonna go ahead and lean back, but I'm gonna encourage you, still engaging the belly muscles, opening the chest up, breathe out, maybe using the elbows to support you a little, just to get into these leg muscles, these tendons, kind of stretching it out, reminding ourselves that we're a whole body, engaging, lengthening, moving, reminding ourselves that motion is lotion. So continue to breathe. We're extending one by one. And then with a nice tight belly, we're gonna take the foot up and rotate the ankle. Okay, outward and inward. Good, release. Taking it up, tight belly. This is a little bit of a core workout. Outward, rotation, and inward. Good, release, awesome. Roll yourself back up, nice tight belly. We're gonna expand our legs a little bit further apart. So widen the knees apart, spreading the toes nice and wide. We're gonna go ahead and take our hands, fingertips on the insides of the legs here. Okay, so now we have this nice little kind of internal rotation of the shoulder. We're gonna go ahead and dip our right shoulder in and our right elbow out. Kind of opening up, giving a little bit of a twist into the back. We're also gently opening and twisting into the belly. So if you've had breakfast already, this kind of assisting into your digestion, reminding ourselves that any time we are kind of twisting, crunching a little into the abdominal space, we're helping our digestion. So don't forget, we're gonna breathe as we dip these shoulders in, getting a nice little stretch into the back, into our shoulders, and we're working with the digestion. Are you breathing? And don't forget to breathe. We're continuing this. We're gonna do one more on each side. So here's the last one on each side. Breathing. Ah, another side. Perfect. Come back to neutral. So shoulders back on top of the waist. Draw the belly in. Chest up, chest up. Crown of the head reaching up to the sky. Arms are gonna come up and breathe out. Open up the arms nice and wide. And now I want you to take a nice side stretch. You got it, come on back up. Open up the arms nice and wide. Side stretch to the other side. Ooh, good, breathing in and out. Only do what's best for you. Reminding yourself that's the beginning of the day. We 
Just trying to get a little motion, lotion, you're going. Breathing in, breathing out. You got it, keep it up. Breathing in and out. Ooh, this is my bad shoulder. That's why I'm like an I'm oofing here. Lift all the way up and release. I'm gonna toe heel, toe heel my feet back underneath so that my feet are right underneath my ankles. I'm gonna go ahead and take my hand step back down onto the thighs, open up my chest for a last cow and cat. Breathing in and out. Well done. Just a quick little morning routine to help you get your day started. Let's take our hands to the heart and I want you to set the intention. We're gonna make it a great day. Thank you everyone. Namaste.